these new AI tools, they're so powerful. I don't know. It's, it's the end of the world. You can build an app without any coding experience and you can sell it online to a lot of people. And all you got to do is to write a text prompt. And it doesn't have to be a specific prompt. It, in fact, it's easier than mid-journey. You just have to talk to it in your natural language. The app is called Lovable. I tried Bolt. That was the other app, and that was in my second video. But Lovable, let me just show you. First of all, you can find it over on Google. I'm not affiliating with them or anything. Lovable Dev, it's going to be the first result here. Actually, this is how it looks like. So idea to app and seconds and this is not drag and drop this is not you know you writing lines of code or whatever this is just you talking to it just like it says in these examples so ask lovable to create an internal tool to create a dashboard and honestly people do get a lot of money on this just on fiverr but let's just do something here Let's just use a default prompt that is here, one of these, before I show you what I made with this, what kind of app I made with this earlier. So let's just go with these recharts dashboard. So a dashboard with beautiful charts using recharts, UI only first, I'll connect real data with Supabase later. So all I have to do is to write the prompt and click on this button here. Of course, you have to sign in first. And you know what's beautiful? You get to see it in action, right? You get to see every step of it while it works. And this is how it looks like. You can always connect to sub base, but actually all you have to do now is to just wait for it, right? It gives you the steps that it's doing and it gives you the overview of what your app or web page or whatever will look like. And as you can see, it's writing the code right away. I don't know if you ever did something like this, but you do can guess at least how much time we would need to write all of this, right? So it's a, it's a life changer. It's not a game changer. It's a life changer. And it's really, really powerful. Anybody can create this. And I really mean it. Anybody can do this. Even teenagers can do this. But it still requires you to be there and to give it a prompt, right? So... Here is the dashboard that we've been looking for. First of all, you can see that it is responsive. It gives you like these months and here it gives you months as well. Down there, you've got monthly performance, which is responsive as well. So this was done in two minutes, maybe less, right? So now I want to create something which is a wealth management app. I actually use ChatGPT to make me the prompt for Lovable. So. I don't even have to write all of this. You can though, if you want to make something specific and that is recommendable. What I did actually is I wrote this. I wanna build wealth management app and I need prompt for cursor because it doesn't know what lovable is. But here it is, it gave me the prompt. So I just copied and pasted. And of course, all you gotta do is to hit the enter button. And of course, it's just gonna do it live in front of you. I'll just speed up the process right now and I'll come back to you with an end result. And honestly, it's scary good. Just scary good. Just have a look at it. So you've got the place for your net worth. You have your monthly income. You have monthly expenses, savings rate, and you've got the whole portfolio, which is responsive as well. You've got savings goals here. And basically, you can, you can just take this and sell it, right, to someone when you import the data that customer gives you with Supplebase and all of that. Also, there's an option to switch to mobile preview mode, which shows you the responsiveness of it as well. It's pretty, pretty good and pretty well made. And you can open up a preview in a new tab if you wanna do it this way. So this is if someone opens it up on desktop device. Now, if you or your customer wants to add something to it, all you gotta do is to ask Lovable about it. You can attach documents, you can attach PDF files, or you can just request some real-time info. For example, you can add a widget. For example, I can write something like this. So add a widget that shows current stock prices, three major ones, and I'll just hit the enter key. I don't have to do anything else. As you can see, I'll create a new stock prices component that displays real-time prices for three major stocks, 
Apple, Microsoft, and Google using mock data since we don't have a real stock API connection yet, which is something that you would do later on when your customer agrees on the style and everything. And here it is, real time. In real time, it added this market watch and it's so powerful, right? So you've got Microsoft, you've got Google, Apple, and of course, it's gonna go live when you connect your API connection to your app or whatever you intend to make. Now, have a look at this. This is what some other person made and he made a prompt like this. So I wanna recreate an old Vista Windows operating system using XP CSS and please create this. So it created all of this and then the person added all of these things here. It added the picture, it added the desktop background here. And look at this, this is responsive, all right? So this is something, this is, really scary right so you can open up documents you can go to these pictures here later on you can add content so this is not only for the apps this is for a lot of things you can just imagine what is possible to do with this app and also you can build web pages no more you know you don't need wordpress you don't need to drag and drop you just give it a prompt and you can sell these online for a lot of money because I found a lot of people who just design a web page for someone and they charge anywhere from 40 to 160, 120, 95 dollars. There's real money in it. And what I love about this one is that you can always upsell your service because, you know, if you create an e-commerce store for someone and then they just add a new item there, they will just call you again to input that new item there in the store, right? So it's really, really good. A lot of Shopify owners, a lot of e-commerce owners need this kind of stuff and they need it fast. And this is what AI does, right? It's good and it's fast. Let's just have a look at this website, e-commerce website. You saw the prompt there. It's just a modern e-commerce product page with image gallery, size, color, variants, review section, and related products. Focus on the UI UX first, and then later on with Supplebase, you will include the product data later because, yeah, your client is going to give you all of that. You just need to show the style whenever you're just getting a new client for a job like this. Now, don't get me wrong, this is not a get rich quick scheme. You have to work on it, you have to work with it, you have to practice, and you have to fix mistakes the mistakes that your client doesn't want or doesn't like. But still, Anybody can do it. You just have to be consistent with it and practice with it and play with it. And here it is. The code is done. The website, the page is done. And this is it. This is the product page. Just have a look at it. It's really neat, right? Really, really neat. You've got pictures here. Of course, you're going to change these with product images. You've got size here. You see L is missing, but you have S. It's really good. The color, add to cart button, the info section here. It's really, really good. Everything you need to take and to sell it online. I just love it, right? It's really good and it's free. You can use it for free. And it truly is your superhuman full stack engineer. Really, really good. I invite you to go over and see what other people did and practice by yourself. And then of course, just throw yourself out there. There's a lot of people who need this kind of service. So yeah, wish you good luck and I'll catch you next time.